do subscribe and click the bell icon for daily defense and space news update. Most of us are eager to know how the comparison of ISRO versus NASA will be. These two space agencies are consistently keeping their position as the top five space agencies in the world. Before start comparing ISRO versus NASA, the background of both organizations should be considered. We all know that NASA is the space agency of United States of America, one of the richest and developed countries in the world. ISRO is the space agency of the India which is a developing country, so the difference in budget and costly technologies will reflect in the performance of both agencies. Even from such thing, ISRO is capable to compete with top spending space agencies like NASA and ISR. So the scale here used for compare as Roe versus NASA will consider these facts also. It totally depends on the aspect which you see. I have listed some of basic differences which will definitely help. NASA has larger workforce than what ISRO currently has. This may seem as a repeating part, but obvious, the funding which each organization receives is still not comparable. To put things into perspective, the total annual budget for NASA 1218.34 billion, and ISRO 90.94 billion. The difference in funds is obvious. NASA's workforce consists of employees from within America to international level. Even there are considerable number of Indians working there. This directly means that they have a large pool of talents, which the organization is extracting in a better way. Many projects executed by NASA are collaborative in nature. For example ISS International Space Station, which was built together by 16 countries. Whereas ISRO completes missions without any assistance from foreign countries. And also, it is not technologically feasible to build ISS by any single space agency. Given the time limit and success rate for any mission, I think, ISRO always tops the list. Dot with its workhorse PSLV Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle, the success rate is estimated to be 93%. And this is considered to be one of the most reliable mode of transport of satellites. NASA doesn't even have a single space vehicle for its transportation. Dot although, Orion is still in its infantry stage it didn't qualify for implementation. ISRO was founded in the year when Neil Armstrong first set his foot on there, this itself says the technological gap between the two agencies. The motto of both the agencies is totally different, as follows, NASA to reach fine new heights and reveal the unknown so that what we do and learn will benefit all humankind ISRO our vision is to harness space technology for national development. While pursuing space science research and planetary exploration we can see a striking difference between these two. First one mainly concentrates the scientific exploration and development and deployment of new technology to further advance science whereas the second one states the need for national development. This itself broadens the gap of comparison between the two agencies. Do subscribe and click the bell icon for daily space and defense news update. Thanks for watching.